Today is day eight of our Christmas Advent calendar and I'm going to talk you through some bridging variations. So your bridge exercise is done on the floor, preferably on a mat, and this exercise strengthens your bottom muscles, your hamstrings and your lower back. So if you come down onto your back with your knees bent, you can pop a pillow under your head if that's going to be more comfortable for you. And then before you come into your bridge, you want to set yourself up so that your feet are about hip distance apart. And then your shoulders are relaxed and you're long through the back of your neck. So to do this, just tuck your chin down into your chest a little bit. As though you've got an orange between your chin and your chest. And then from here, to come up into your bridge, you're going to roll your bottom off of the mat, so imagining that you're peeling your spine off of the mat, until you're in your full bridge position, and then roll back down again. Okay, so this is option one. As I say, feet are about hip distance apart, you're rolling up, squeezing your bottom muscles, and then rolling back down again. Okay, so you can either do that option as, um, as it is there, or if you want, you can pop something in between your knees, so whether that be a foam roller or a pillow. So this just activates the mus muscles on the inside of your legs a little bit more, alongside your bottom muscles and your hamstrings. So with whatever object you're using between your knees, from there you're going to roll up into your bridge, and then roll back down again. Okay, so that's a slightly different option to your normal bridge. And then, to make it harder if you would like to, you can roll up into your bridge, keeping a good squeeze on your bottom muscles, keeping your tummy muscles nice and tight. From here, you can just straighten one leg, pop that leg back down, straighten the other, pop that back down and then roll back down onto the floor. So the key thing with that one is to make sure that you don't lose any height in your bridge as you come over onto one leg. So you're looking to keep your hips in about the same line as you go from two legs to one leg. Okay? And then the last option, if that's a little bit too tricky but you want to work your bottom muscles a little bit more, you can roll up into your bridge. Holding that position, you can then roll your knee out to the side, bring it back to the middle, and then roll your other knee out to the side. So the key things with this one is to make sure that your non-moving leg stays completely still as the other leg is rolling in and out. And again, keeping your tummy muscles tight, bum muscles a little bit squeezed and then keeping the neck and shoulders nice and relaxed.